Hi guys, welcome to another episode of m as Mystery Tours. Now we're at the Manum Cemetery. This one is really, really huge, quite big. Um, we got football going on here, golfers, and also a blower, <sighs> Mr. Law Malmeen. Uh, yeah. Um, all right, let's go take a look around and see what we can find. Here we go, guys. Which way shall we start? I reckon. Goodbye. Start here. Goodbye. I only just got here. What do you mean goodbye? See what I mean by huge. It is massive, massive cemetery. But, excuse me, I'm only doing this section here. And uh, see what we can find. But to start off with, let's think, introduce myself. Stop. Uh, hello to. Oh, I'm stopping. Hello to all the spirits here. My name is Mark. And when I leave from here today, you cannot attach yourself to us or our equipment. You must stay here in your resting place. Do I make myself clear? And I'm here only to say hello, no disrespect or anything like that. Just here to say hello and that's it. And does any spirits here like to come and say hello? Any spirits like to come and say hello? I know it's a bit noisy, guys. Hope he doesn't come up too far. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear in the background, but... You have got you got the football, you got golfers, everything's happening today. <laughs> but oh well, I've got to keep marching on because I don't want to come around the third time round. <laughs> That's what we've been doing is catching up on the um, the cemetery because we lost a whole heap on the phone with ghost tube somehow ghost tube disappeared off the phone and I am close and because it's disappeared off the phone the videos went with it but we still had photos which was really, really weird but oh well It happens. Here we have Rosanna, beloved wife of James Atwell, died 7th of June 1898, aged 79 years. Um, Tis hard to say farewell, also James, died 14th of December 1902, aged 83 years. And so, R. Uh, Aveline Burt, daughter 
of above, died 2nd of January 1917, aged 65 years, and her husband Simon died 21st of June 1921, aged 83 years. Rest in peace, guys. Yeah. Hmm. Broken. This one needs a bit, a little bit of repairing, that's all. And also, got the stone ones here. Why? I don't know. I don't know why. Any spirits like to come and say hello? This one's Willy, Willy B R I N E. Um, son of Edward Charles. Pardon? Yeah, that's all I'm interested in is the old one. Where it's like um, they're really uh, dicey. There's like this corner used to have a lot more too. Yeah. I think. Okay. Yeah. But yeah. Like there's a couple here. Yeah. And like, you've just got to be careful where you walk us on, okay. on the journey. Yep. Yeah. Okay. There's like, yeah, quite a few of these all around the yeah. way. Stop it! I just got to be careful of where I'm stepping. Yeah, Because I don't yeah. want to disrespect anything. Yeah, that's yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's what I try not to do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's hard, isn't it? Yeah, especially... Yeah, like this bit here is a bit, bit dicier, but like the other sides are not so bad, like that side's not so bad. Yeah. This is corner. Yeah. It's a bit, you know. Yeah, this is all I do. I don't, where the new ones are, leave them alone. Yeah. <laughs> I don't do those ones. Yeah. yeah these, are, these are like more I just forgot about, I suppose. Yeah. You know? Unfortunately. Yeah. Okay, you found a golf ball. Yeah, yeah I don't mind hitting one once in a while. <laughs> oh. uh, That's the perch, I suppose. Yeah. Golf area. Yeah. Sweet, eh? Yep, you too. Alright, right, see you later. Oh, there you go, guys. Apparently there is people buried around the area, but as he said, it's hard to tell whether you're stepping, where you're stepping, hey, so just got to be careful, hey, yeah.
So there is a lot more people um, buried Coffin. around the place. But you just got to be careful on where you're stepping. Um, and where he was pointed was around the tree areas. He said there was people buried there, but you can't see where where they're buried. So it makes it a little bit difficult. Hunt. Um, yeah, it finds it a little bit difficult to see because it's, it's not visible to, you know, no, yeah. Okay, any spirits here like to come and say hello? See, even the lawnmower or mower guys, they have trouble where to step as well. As, as you heard the guy saying, it's quite hard to tell where you're stepping. You just got to be careful. And the ones that you can see, well, well that's obvious, isn't it? <laughs> so, there you go. So if anyone out there is interested and before they come and, and comment down below or you just heard it from the man himself. So yeah. Deep, yeah, um, it would be buried quite deeply. Oh, I see some of the Graves need to be cleaned, as I said before, or well, not today, but I said it in one of my videos that I'd like to do a clean up around the area. See, there's some more down in that section down here and down there but they're all newies around that area I, and you've got your little one over this corner over here well not in the corner but here I'll come up close to this one and this one you've got your little one as well there church yeah there is probably a church close by but here you have the little ones here a little one over there that hasn't got anything there Yeah. I do like the cross down there if I can get to it from here.
And he got the cross. That is pretty good. Rent out all of wood. Well, and there's no ones here. back up here they the cars have been up here Yeah, looks like cars come up here as well because there's tyre tracks all here along this path area but I don't know why they do that because <coughs> phone yeah phone that's right correct I am holding a phone correct um, here it's all tyre marks and stuff here as well so um, there's probably unmarked graves along here so they shouldn't be driving on a unmarked graves if there is unmarked graves <coughs> so they shouldn't be doing that <coughs> should be parking your car park or car in the car park. Hey, uh, yeah. Good. My angel again. And the angel is good. Do a, an S box session, guys. See what we. S box. Scanning. Sorry if I'm going a bit too fast with that. Hey, any spirits here like to come and say hello? Eighteen eighty-seven, age fifty-two years. 
Cindy uh, also ready for in such an hour as she can not the son of man coming. Bible verse. Also, Jacob, Kent, husband of the above, who died October 9, 1901, age 61, is blessed by waiting for the coming of the of the Savior. Amen. Yeah. Got the two lonely crosses. Thank you. Thank you for speaking with me. Okay. Grandfather. Yeah, there's probably someone's grandfather here. Um, looks like I've covered all around here now. I reckon it's been, here we go, been half an hour, I hope. Here's a Frederick, Mr. Frederick, 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 <laughs> 8th of May, 1887, 14th of March, 1899, son of Mary Ann and William traditionally drowned oh this is oh. see I wish I had that other one now because I remember the word came out drowned and it was here yeah. <laughs> and this one and that one. Okay, guys, I'm gonna leave it there and um, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, MA Mystery Tours. Come over, give us the subscribe, like, comment, share. And that will be all much appreciated, guys. And thank you very much for watching. Ciao for now, guys.